hey guys welcome to my channel again it's gerard here and in today's video i'll be showing you guys how to safely back up your wordpress site uh i'm making this video because i saw i was on Quora the other day and i saw a lot of questions about how to back up your wordpress site a lot of people are having issues doing this sometimes your hosting goes down and most times sometimes your your hosting provider doesn't provide a backup for you so how are you going to provide a backup for yourself just in case anything happens because if it goes down you might lose everything so in this video i'll be showing you guys how to do this and back up your wordpress site okay this is basically on wordpress see wordpress is your area so i if you have a wordpress site then this is the perfect one for you all right so without wasting much time just get down to visit if you're new here i really make it easy for the tutorial so i advise you to like this video subscribe to my channel and also turn on the post notification and if you have any comments drop it in the comment section below and i'll be there to attend to your comment all right so uh i'll be showing you two methods two methods to do this okay very easy it's not complicated at all anyone can do it at all anyone as long as you have uh idea about how to what how wordpress works all right so the first one is that you have to come to tools here all right so when you come here uh, you would want to come to uh export here all right you want to come to export so you would like want to click on export to let it load this is like a random site that i'll have so uh we're using it so if you look at here you see all content all right uh choose what to export so here you can basically uh this is like a manual backup all right so here basically what you can what you want to do is that you want to uh basically uh, export all the content on your website export all of them download it and keep it in a very very safe place all right just in case but if you don't want like, a lot of uh, files here if you don't want you can just remove it from this all content and just select it once you want maybe the post you get like you can even select the categories that you want or the select dates within the time frame that you want you can select the pages cancelate it like there's a lot here all right so it just depends on if you want you can select all the media and download it okay all right so uh but for the uh, sake of this video we would like to make use of all contents all right so when you click on all contents everything here you'll be able to download it and back and save it somewhere just in case if you lose access to uh any of this all right so you want to come here when you click there you do want to come here and click on download export file you see and voila within a few seconds our site is downloaded so if you have any issues just in case if you lose your files you can just come back here come to these tools click on import you can just come back here click on import and you'll be able to speak a wordpress here so you have to just click on install and you'll be able to import everything that you have downloaded this is you can also back up your site and take it to a whole different domain all right so this works perfectly too so uh that takes you to step number three number two sorry i'll be making use of a plugin all right so all you have to do is just to come to plugins come to add new plugins okay so when you come we just let it load and you want to come here and search for duplicator duplicator oh sorry i spelled that wrong all right so that's for duplicator all right this is the plugin i'll be making use of all right so we just come here and you install the plugin you want to install the plugin and let it install so you just load in now it's done so when it's installed you just have to come and activate the plugin all right it's not difficult you just activate the plugin and this is where it's going to take you all right so you see create your face page and all of that so but what you'll be doing mostly is that you'll be working here all right so you just have to come to this plugin look at here all right and you come to uh pack uh you want to come here all right so you have to create a new package all right all right you have to create a new package so you want to create a new package you come here click on create new all right so now it automatically gives you a name all right so now uh 
this is going to back up like literally everything here right if you want to put any zip you do that then the next thing you have to do is just to click on next then you'll be able to extract it and download into your system and keep it safe and you just do whatever you want to do whenever you want to do it all right so that's all for this video if you're new here please subscribe to my channel turn the post notification and don't forget to also like this video all right like i said these are the two methods by which you can use to back up your wordpress site okay so so thanks for watching see you in the next video